Genesis chapter 4 verses 8 to 10. Now Cain said to his brother, Let us go out to the field. While they were there in the field, Cain attacked his brother Abel and killed him. Then the Lord God said to Cain, Where is your brother Abel? I don't know, he replied. Am I my brother's keeper? The Lord said, What have you done? Listen, your brother's blood cries out to me from the ground. There are so many people hearing voices in their head and they don't even know what is the cause of those voices. There are so many people who have been distressed in the world. There are so many people with blood in their hands and they don't even know what is causing them to not feel comfortable and not have a very good sound sleep in the night. Genesis chapter 4 verses 8 present the very first murder case in the Bible where human being was involved. We saw Cain kill his brother Abel and hide him so that nobody will see him. There are so many people out there who have blood in their hand, who have killed somebody, who have by some way somehow murdered somebody and have hidden them knowing that they, nobody will see them, thinking that nobody will hear about them, thinking that nobody will even discover what has happened. And and so because of this, they are walking up and down, they are going to and fro with so many things hanging around their mind. There are over 400,000 homicide cases in the world every year and there are over 55 billion babies being killed innocently every single year. There have been so many mysteries surrounding so many deaths all across the globe and so many people involved in these mysteries some way somehow think that they are they will never be discovered or some way somehow that they will not be seen or the mysteries will not be unraveled. One thing that I can tell you for this is it doesn't matter how long, it doesn't matter how many years it takes for mysteries to be unraveled. One thing for sure and one thing that is certain is they will be unraveled and why do you think they will be unravel? This leads us to the very second mysteries of a blood. This mystery is that in God's providence, blood speaks and blood has a voice before the presence of God. And so all the people that have been involved in murders, all innocent lives that have been shed, all babies that have lost their life through innocent means, all those millions of babies that have lost their lives, every single person that has lost his life in some way some or the other by another person, all those blunts are crying out every single day all around the globe. So in every Every single minute in every single hour blood is speaking blood is crying in Genesis chapter 4 verses 10 the Lord says that what have you done listen your brother's blood cries out to me from the ground so there are blood every single time crying out from the ground crying out from the hospital crying out from the bushes crying out from the gutters, crying out from every single corner of this world to the Lord. And all they are saying is, when, O oh Lord, are you going to avenge our death? And so there is a question mark. There is always judgment being pronounced upon every single one in these murder cases. And so, so many people out there that are involved in these cases, some way, somehow, if it can take years, it can take hundreds of years, it can take tens of years. But one thing that is for sure is that the Lord God will bring them out one by one because of the cry of the blood. Blood speaks and before God, blood has a voice that God cannot ignore because in God's own providence, he gave blood a voice and when blood cries out, anytime blood opens its mouth, to God and says and make a petition. God cannot sit in his throne but to act and that is why it doesn't matter what happens, it doesn't matter how long those things happen, it doesn't matter who did it. One thing that is for sure is that God in his rightful time bringeth forth revenge to make sure that these blood that speak it have their voices been responded to. In the 1970s and 1980s, the Golden State Killer terrorized the whole of California residents for so long, killing so many people, as many as 9 and raping as many as 45 women. It took 40 years. 
for that killer to be fished out and so it doesn't matter how long it takes it doesn't matter how many years it will take one thing that is certain is this that one mystery of blood is that blood has a voice and blood will always cry out to the lord and the lord will not ignore the cry of a blood this is one huge mystery of blood and that is why blood cannot be taken for granted god made blood unique and god made blood unique not because it is red but because blood irrespective of the fact that it is scientifically unique it also has a voice before the presence of the lord a voice that god will not ignore Thank but why should blood have a voice why should god give blood a voice before his throne this is one of the mysteries that we'll be looking at in our next video and so i want you to take a time and follow this lessons i want you to take a time and share with friends i want you to take a time and study these mysteries and i believe that your life will not be the same i believe that god will speak to you in diverse ways that you have never heard before i believe that god will bless your life and let you see the world in a different way and let you see how he wants to connect with you god bless you even as you follow this series and god bless you even as you share with friends